Just got this in. So it, uh, a friend of mine was using it on his car, on his SUV. He pulls out this device, and I'm like, what the heck is that? <clears throat> he sticks it in the door hinge area where the uh, door itself locks onto on the physical door. And it was a step, and he was able to get on top. So I would love to have this from my van. I'm not a tall guy, so this will help very, very much. So I'm going to see how it works. This is it inside. Oh, it comes in a nice bag. Yeah, nice bag. This will be kept in the glove compartment. 60 actual instructions and the measurements, as you can see. And, uh, okay. Other side. Let's open up the bag. It's a string tie bag. And, uh, so this is the device itself. It is steel. It is hard. And it has a rubber piece here. This rubber piece is made to protect the car itself so that when you step on it, it doesn't scratch the car. Wow, this is like heavy duty. And this is what hooks on to the um, hook or loop or whatever it's called. I don't know the exact name. On the actual physical body of the car. This will hook on it and then this will um, be against the side underneath on the side of the uh, doorway entrance. And you put your foot on there and you can climb up onto the top without a problem at all. This is really nice. Let me show you how it's set up. I'm going to put it on and uh, climb on top of it and show you how it works. And it comes in a nice bag. This is a really nice bag. I also want to mention that this is kept in your glove compartment. So when it's closed, this is actually... Uh, doubles as a uh, window breaker so this will break the window in case you ever you know the car falls into a lake or something and uh, this is what you use to break the glass that's what that's for so this is a, it's good to keep it in the glove compartment in the bag that it came in and uh, I, I think it's a great idea what a simple idea too bad I didn't think of it Okay, supports up to 510 pounds. So there's a certain hinge you're not supposed to use it on. Supposedly there's a new type of hinge. So that's the left is a standard one. The picture doesn't show it very well, but it's standard one. The other one are some new ones. The website will give you a better description. That's how you use it. That's how you use it. That's how you use it. And that's it. Alright. Let me try it out. This is my van. And many times I'm trying to reach the top to load stuff up there. Usually garbage. Um, we have a central location where we all throw our garbage in and I throw the bags up there and I go about 10 miles an hour till I get to the garbage area and then I can throw it out. I hate when the garbage leaks into the car so I usually throw it on top. It's not a big deal but I can't get up there especially with very heavy bags. It's hard to throw it up there. Sometimes the plastic bags catch to the ends over there and they rip. It's a mess out here so I got to clean it all up. 
So I'm hoping this solves the issue. So this is my van. And one of the issues I already saw was that when I open it up, the hook that I got to hook that onto, it's too far in. It's about 12 inches in. So it's, you know, it's not reachable. So I found that on the front door, I can put it on here and still get the same reach and same area. So let me show you. That's the actual item. So let me put it in. Just pull the hook up. And put it in there. And um, now it's a step, which is great. So let me show you how it works. So let's, for example, say that this is garbage I need to throw away. And it's a big, heavy bag. It's difficult. So again, where I'm going to keep this, I mean, it's just an awesome idea. I'll keep this here, take this out, close it, and I clip it right in my glove compartment. Because like I said, the edge here is used for, God forbid, you're ever submerged in water in your car. This is you break the glass so you can get out of your car. Because if you're submerged in water, you'll never get the door open. So that's what this is for. So you can keep this in the glove compartment with the bag or without. The, I'm keeping it without the bag. I'm not going to struggle with getting this item out of the bag. When I need an emergency, I need it. So I'd probably use the bag for something else. And I'm going to use this just the way it is. Awesome. Awesome product. I'm really happy I got it. And thank you to my friend. Don't want to mention his name, but he's the one who showed me this. And I liked it very much. Sold it on Amazon. Bought it. No regrets. Probably buy another one for my other car. Okay. I hope you liked the video. Thank you.